God doesn't want to lose anybody. He doesn't want to lose one soul. He wants everybody to make heaven their home. And he's provided a way through the blood sacrifice of his son, Jesus Christ. It even says in the word of God, Ezekiel chapter 18, verse 21 through 23. Listen, follow me. It says, suppose the wicked stop doing all the sins they have done and obey all my rules and do what is fair and right. Then they will surely live. They will not die. It says their sins will be forgotten because they have done what is right. They will live. I do not really want the wicked to die, says the Lord God. I want them to stop their bad ways and live. God knew that we couldn't uh, follow the commandments, that no person is good enough to follow them blamelessly. So he provided a way for us to have a relationship with him. And that's through believing in his son, Jesus Christ, that he was the Lord and uh, our Lord and Savior, that he is the way, the truth, and the life, and that nobody can make it to heaven except through him, you guys. So believe, you guys, believe that Jesus Christ is the Messiah, that he came to this earth for us and bore or our sins on the cross. Hey y'all, Jesus is coming. He is coming sooner than we all think. Let me tell y'all, three months ago, I had a dream that felt so real. I had a dream that Jesus came and I was sobbing because I was left behind. And God came to me and he said, tell my people, warn my people that I am coming and they better repent and turn away from the, their sins. And I don't know about you guys, but I don't want to be left behind and I don't want you guys to let, be left behind. So get right with God. Turn away from your sins and seek God wholeheartedly. Because when you get to heaven, bitterness, anger, all that's not going to matter. God's not going to go to you and ask you how many followers or how many likes you had on TikTok or if you got your car or how much money is in your bank account. None of that's going to matter. None of it. So get right with God. Get right with Him. If you're not ashamed of the gospel of Jesus Christ, I want you to share this video. The Bible says that you believe in your heart and confess with your mouth that Jesus is Lord, you will be saved. Jesus is the only way to heaven. There's no other way. I challenge every Christian on here. To Let me tell you something. You will get nowhere with hate. The Bible says in 1 John chapter 3, 15, everyone who hates his brother is a murderer. And you know that no murderer has eternal life abiding in them. If you hate someone, you the Bible says you're a murderer, okay? You know that streamer that killed himself because of all the hate? The little eight-year-olds, the 10-year-olds, the young people that will kill themselves because they cannot handle the hate that they get in school. The adults that are in abusive situations and couples that they just, they can't handle so they kill themselves because they think it's better. You are hurting people. You are, with your words, you physically hurt people or physically with all your hate. Oh, I love you, baby. But then you hit them. That's hateful. That is, that is horrible. Stop hating on people because you won't make it into heaven. If you're a Christian and you do this, you better change your ways right now, immediately. Don't wait till tomorrow. Change them right now because God will not accept you. God loves you and he always will.